What's up guys? Um, if you saw the, the title of the video, then you know what I'm about to tell you. I went to the doctor the other day and he told me what I already knew. He told me that I am obese. Um, I've sort of like been fluctuating in the obesity range for some time now. Um, even last year when I dropped all that weight, I was still, you know, quite overweight. Um, so bit of a wake up call, I guess, like when you actually hear it from the doctor. Uh, the reason that I went to the doctor is it was for a follow up. Um, I, a few months ago, as you would know, if you've seen a couple of my last videos, I went to um, psychologist and started doing some therapy. And that was on the back of the doctor's uh, recommendation my GP, uh, and I actually was meant to go back and see him a while ago, but I, I finally went and saw him the other day for a checkup, and we discussed a few things. So I've booked in myself for a sleep study, because uh, I know that I do snore pretty badly, um, and it's obviously affecting everything. I mean, sleep is pretty much the most important part of your life, really, um, you know, in terms of recovery and overall wellness, alertness, energy, all of that sort of stuff. So um, it's well overdue. I should have gone and seen a doctor about this a long time ago. Uh, and the lack of sleep and poor sleep will definitely be adding to my weight issues as well uh, and hindering my, my efforts that I'm putting in at the gym. So um, I'll get that booked in in the next couple of days. And I guess I'll do a vlog about that when that happens, when that's all booked in. Um, the other thing that I spoke to him about as well was uh, some blood tests. So I had a blood test. I haven't really had that many blood tests I should start off with throughout my life. Um, I've kind of been one of those typical kind of guys who neglects uh, his health a little bit in terms of going to see the doctor. Um, and I've, I've made some big changes there, some big strides. So I go and see the doctor regularly now. And I asked him if I could get some, some blood work done. So uh, the next video that I do, like fitness related one in a couple of days or the next week or so, will be based around, uh, you know, what results I get, pardon me, what results I get from that, uh, from that blood test, or well, post-workout proteins coming back to haunt me. Um, yeah, so, I mean, hopefully it's all good news, it's all, we'll, we'll see, but I've, I've asked him if I could get testosterone checked, um, electrolytes, he wanted to check, um, fasted blood sugar levels, um, cholesterol, lipids, um, all that sort of stuff. So, you know, fingers crossed, mainly all good news. And I'll, if, if it's, you know, you know, as long as it's nothing catastrophic, I'll make a video about it and tell you guys what's up. Um, and yeah, then hopefully that'll coincide with, with some more news on the sleep study. So that's a, a little uh, update as to my health and my overall life at the moment. Um, today, I went to the gym and I'm about to show you guys some video of what I did today and on Saturday. So we're going to start off with what I did on Saturday. Uh, I did some strongman training and I hit two really good PBs. So I hit uh, 80 kilogram log clean and press and it was really easy. Like it flew up. Uh, definitely got more in the tank definitely going to hit that 85 kilogram target that I had for this year. Um, it makes me, you know, think if I COVID hadn't hit and I was able to come to the gym for those, you know, four or four months or so that it was shut down, uh, you know, what I could have done in terms of my, my log press. So 80, 80 kilos I hit on the log press and then I hit a 200 kilogram yoke walk. So I walked it for 10 meters, had a quick rest and then picked it up and walked it back to the start a couple of times um, in terms of you know, my plantar fasciitis, it was really good to, to get, you know, a bit of weight on my back and go for a walk and not feel any strain on my feet. So I'm going to get stuck into the strongman training a bit more, just keep an eye on the feet. And then I'm going to bring you today, I'm going to show you all of my, my warm up lifts all the way up to my top set on my deadlift. And uh, today was week two of block three. So it was the three rep day. So the top three sets were uh, three reps um, and then you know that that final top set is um, as many reps as possible am wrap and I hit five off the top of my head five at 165 kilos pretty happy with that well on the way to a 200 kilo deadlift again uh, then the next target will be 250 once I hit 200 
Uh, then I hit a little rep PB on the overhead press, 60 kilograms for six reps, which is really good. I'm, I'm super stoked with my progress, you know, getting things back on track post COVID, post anxiety, we're still working on anxiety and depression and all those things, but feeling really good, really energized. So without further ado, I've waffled on enough. Let's get stuck into some gym footage. And if anything else happens today that's exciting, I'll bring you guys along for it. If not, subscribe, like, hit the like button, smash the like button, whatever all the YouTubers say. Uh, leave me a comment if you think anything, any of these lifts are cool, or you want to talk about weight loss, testosterone, any of that kind of stuff, let me know down, down below. Uh, yeah, hopefully something else will happen today and I'll see you after this little bit. Shake it, baby. Shake your baby. 